Hi, Bright Souls. I know it's been a while since I've made a video. I um, wanted to go ahead and make this one and give you an update, let you know uh, what's been going on with me. So, um, I haven't gotten back on track yet with my eating. Um, I keep saying I'm going to do that. I'm going to get with the program tomorrow. And tomorrow comes and goes and and uh, I'm still uh, not on track. Um, I did find all of, I did unpack all of my um, test uh, equipment. So I know that my uh, fasting blood sugar is hanging in, hanging around like the low um, 200s, like around, you know, 213. So um, that's, you know, still 100 points higher than it should be for a fasting, uh, over 100 points. So not good. Um, it's definitely gone back up. Um, but that's to be expected with the high stress levels that I'm experiencing and all of what I'm going through at the moment uh, and the fact that I'm not back on track with my eating. Um, my weight's hanging around 213, which is also um, up a few pounds. So I'm under a great deal of stress right now and I'm really struggling, really struggling with um, you know, sugar cravings and with... Um, with uh, eating correctly. Well, let me back it up a step and explain what all the stress is about. So if you've been following uh, my latest videos, you know that I have uprooted my entire family and um, relocated to a new city um, so that I could take a, a new position with my, with my um, current uh, employer. So um, still working for the same company, but I'm in a new city and um, working with a new team and new projects and all that. Well, it's been extremely stressful um, because I've been having um, more work handed to me than is possible uh, for the size of my team. And so just to um, keep my head above water, uh, just to make our deadlines, I've been putting in, on average, uh, 12 hours every day, plus I'm working Saturday and Sunday also, so seven days a week. And uh, it's basically been that way for uh, two months now. Well, I think a little bit less than two months anyway, since I, since I, I got here. And uh, there is an end in sight because um, I had two big projects that I needed to uh, accomplished by the by the end of the month and that's almost here uh, so I've um, you know I haven't been um, taking any breaks during the day I haven't been taking lunch uh, I may may take a, a, a lunch break you know w once a week um, it's a bad situation because it's a very steep learning curve everything is new and uh, you know it's an extremely busy time and all new folks, you know, my entire team, including me, were all new. So I don't have anybody to go to, you know, for help or to ask questions or, you know, to help us get, get over hurdles. we got to muddle through it ourselves, and that just takes a long time. Um, technically, there are people that we're supposed to be able to go to for help, um, but a lot of those folks are actually um, leaving the company. Uh, and are being replaced uh, by new by new people, so uh, they're not very willing to help. <laughs> put it that way. Um, anyway, so I I've just been really tired and really stressed, and you know, worried. Uh, you know, if I'm going to survive this job, um, you know, it's it's uh, it's a new boss and and all that, and and I, uh, you know, I've I've been giving everything I have to the job because I don't want to get fired or I don't want to, you know, um, fail at the position. So I'm under a great deal of stress and, uh, you know, I've, <laughs> haven't actually broke down and cried, but, <laughs> but I have come close a couple of times. You know, there, I have days where it's like, I don't think I'm going to survive this day. I don't think I'm going to make it. And then I have other days where I'm like, okay, well, you know, I got through it, you know, and, and, Maybe I will come out of this, you know, <laughs> on top. Um, so, yeah, just, uh, you know, just a very bad situation to be in, you know, in, in addition to being new, in addition to not really having anybody to go to for answers and for help, in addition to, you know, just a ton of work being dumped on us um, 
with deadlines that we can't get out of, you know, um, you know, somebody else has decided, you know, your projects have to be done by this date, you know, make it happen. So, uh, what that means for me is I, I'm, I'm very stressed and, uh, I am not sleeping well. Um, I, I'll give you an example. Last night, this, or I guess technically early this morning, uh, I woke up at 2 a.m. and as soon as my, you know, eyes popped open, I was like, oh, I didn't do this. I, I need to be able to get this done. And so I, I got up out of my bed and got on the computer and got that task accomplished and then went back to bed. And so it's, it's like every waking moment is, is, you know, work oriented and, and occupying all of my thoughts. And by the time I get home, of course, I'm, I'm tired. And, uh, so, you know, we've been doing a lot of takeout. We've been doing a lot of frozen dinners. Um, and the, like I probably mentioned it, but the sugar cravings are through the roof. Um, I have not given in to any chips cravings. Um, I've been tempted, uh, but I haven't given in to any of those. So I'm still, I'm still doing good in that regard. Uh, have not gone back to chips. Um, with the chocolate uh, or the sweet cravings, I've been eating some of the um, Amy's chocolates because they they are they have stevia in them instead of sugar. But I've also been doing regular you know candy bars and and cookies and things like that too. Stress eating basically. <laughs> I mean that's really what I'm doing. Um, so I'm hoping to get back on track soon when my work schedule is more normal. Um, I mean I I I've been putting in a lot. You know, just simply because, like I said, I'm afraid, uh, you know, to lose my job. I'm afraid to, you know, not meet my performance expectations, you know, with my new boss and my new project team and things like that. So, you know, I've, I've always done a really good job. Um, and, and so, you know, I don't know how real that possibility is, but I don't want to find out. <laughs> and, uh, and so I've been, you know, really, um, you know, just a hundred percent on work and neglecting my health and neglecting my family too. You know, um, my husband says, you know, I hardly ever see you, you know, you come home, we have dinner, we go to bed and then you get up and you're gone again the next day. And then, you know, when you are home on the weekends, you're working, you know, so yeah, I'm just not, not really spending the kind of time that I want to spend with my family. Haven't seen any of the city, of the new city. I haven't done any driving around or exploring or going out and doing anything, you know. So, um, boy, this wasn't really what I wanted this video to be about. I guess I didn't really know. I didn't have a plan going into it. But, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm off track. Uh, I'm really struggling. Uh, but my plan is to get back on track and to, you know, refocus uh, my attention on, on, on my health. It's just right now, I kind of feel like I'm in survival mode and I have to... I have to make it through, um, you know, right, right now I, my, my income is the only income since I uprooted my family. Uh, you know, my husband isn't employed yet, so it, it's even more pressure for me, you know, not to lose this job or not to perform poorly and, and you know, get written up and that sort of thing. So it, it's a great deal of pressure right now and a great deal of stress. And, um, I feel like, you know, this is where my attention needs to be. I need to survive this. I need to get through these two projects and I mean the work will always be coming there will never be a shortage of work but it won't be this insane uh, at least I'm hoping not so yeah just wanted to say hi and let you know I'm still around the reason I haven't been making videos is just because I really just have not had time um, you know when I'm not at work then you know I'm trying to trying to get some rest um, you know I, I just don't haven't had a lot of time but uh, I haven't given up and I haven't lost um, the desire to improve my health and to and to eat right and to lose weight. And, you know, um, I've, I've taken a hit. I've taken a few steps back, but that's the way it is sometimes. Like I said, I'm I feel like I'm struggling to survive right now. And and I'm putting I don't know, you, I guess maybe you could make the argument that my priorities aren't straight, but uh I feel they are. I feel they're where they need to be right now, and uh, I'll get back on track, uh, you know, as soon as I'm in a in a good space to do that. Uh, and right now, I just don't feel like I am. So anyway, um, I'm I'm hoping, like I said, uh, it's today is the what is today? 
24th of, of uh, August. Oh my gosh. Yeah, today's the 24th of August. And, um, uh, and I'll be, I'll be finishing up a lot of the work by Friday and, um, and, and definitely by next week, a lot of the, the, these two big projects will be behind me. So, uh, at that time I'll hopefully return to a more normal work schedule. Uh, also make more regular videos. I want to get back into the swing of that and, um, and, uh, start, you know, improving my health and, uh, eating right, moving my body and, enjoying life and all that good stuff. <laughs> so, um, until the next video, take care.